the premium fly night head guard in the leather. Hello and welcome to fit to box channel I'm Simon, full time amateur coach and here on fit to box channel I show you all things boxing equipment. Please like and subscribe and don't forget to jab that notifications bell for all my latest uploads. Today I have got a superb head guard from Fly, the Fly Knight and this is the leather version of the Fly Knight head guard I have reviewed before the Fly X line night and uh, I've rated and ranked that and today I'm going to show you all around this one and give the rating and ranking for this as well okay so as always with fly gear you do get the box you also get uh, the bag as well to store the item in and then of course you get the beautiful item that is this one here and this in the ox blood and as you can see from the styling with the gold fly emblem and that ox blood and as I bring it round it is a beautiful head guard and this construction is beautiful so what I'm going to do I'll just go through it with you you have got on the front there you have got great padding on the forehead then on the sides again you've got some nice padding soft padding at the rear there you've got some really good ear donuts with the ear bar You've got the lace at the back, you've also got the lace at the top and at the bottom they've gone with a belt and buckle leather uh, attachment at the bottom. Okay. Now as you know I prefer the clip to that, I uh, just think that's just a little bit more fiddly if you're going to use that each time. Of course I always recommend if you've got belt and buckle there that you don't ever really change it once you've got it in place and that you open it up really at the back and slide your head in okay so I'm going to do that so that way you're not in the gym looking in the mirror trying to find a hole that is in the leather strap as you can see there it's very easy in that position then to tie the back just by feeling the laces the top you can see there brings in sort of the top and then at the rear I can just tie that no problem at all and then as you can see you've got a very protective head guard here in the especially in the front bit okay blows coming straight in are really going to be caught by these pieces here which is the winning FG 2900 that's where that is inspired from those cheap bars at the front on this one I think these actually jut out a little bit more which does give you a little bit more protection as well it's, as it's around my head, this one in the Oxblood, it's a little bit stiffer than you'd find on the normal leather versions of the fly head guards, but that will soften up. There's a lad at the gym that has got one of these. He's got a blue one. Uh, he's used it a tremendous amount. He's had it for a few years now. Softened up lovely, and he loves that head guard. So let me just show you here. I'm looking. I can see the bars there. Um, the only thing I would say is... The, the, the vision at the sides is a little bit limited. Um, as I look there, I can see sort of here, down. I've got good vision there. It sort of bevels up a little bit as well. So you've got a little bit more vision there. But I have to say, I have had uh, head guards whereby this part here gives you more vision, peripheral vision to the sides. Okay, if I just show you to the side there. And then also if I show you to the rear what that looks like and then I'll show you again to there but it's a really really well made head guard um, the price of this is 245 English pounds so it's not a cheap head guard it is a beautiful leather head guard and top of the range when it comes to flies head guards they come in small medium large and extra large and as I say when I take this off what I do is I open it up really a lot at the back okay to enable myself to slide it off like so
Okay, just to weigh this head guard, just put it onto there like so. Nice one. 10.9, that is a really light head guard, especially for a leather head guard. So let me get up on screen the fit to box ratings card for this head guard. Okay, style, I've gone 96. Comfort, this one is a little stiffer than the X-Line, but it definitely will soften with use. I've gone 96. Durability, beautiful leather, very well made. I've gone 97. Vision, I've gone 94. That's just because of that sort of side vision, really. Um, I think that in the Fly X, even though I thought that these were based on the same design, it does seem that this is a little bit deeper that my eyes are sitting and so therefore I have gone 94 vision protection though those jutting cheek bars at the front give great protection and uh, so I've gone 96 for the protection value for money at 245 English pounds I've gone 94 so this head guard comes out with a total score of 95.5 that is three fit to box stars. That is excellent. I love what they've done. This is really great head guard. I'm expecting this head guard to get better and better the more that I use it. It's that kind of item really. Pretty much like a Claytor Reyes head guard, which is a leather head guard that the more you use, the more it molds to your head, the softer it gets, the better it gets. And so this head guard is pretty much the same when I think about what this will be like in six months time. I really do think that this is um, sort of an excellent head guard now, but as it molds to my head, I think it will get better and better. So I hope you enjoyed that. Please like and subscribe to Fit to Box channel, and I shall speak to you soon.